truly is a very sloppy start to the day, but we're ending the new year on a positive note because a warm front will move in overnight. Right now we're coming in 39 degrees. Music City, you are saturated out there. Roadways are wet. We've got standing water in a handful of spots. However, our flood threat is on the lower end of things. Just be mindful you want to drive the road conditions not necessarily the speed limit because there are going to be a few spots that are easy to hydroplane and that does include the interstate. Right now we're coming in 39 degrees in Nashville with winds out of our north six miles per hour. So far outside of our particular camera, we received half an inch of rain and that's not the highest over in portions of Hopkinsville. You've had seven tenths of an inch, so obviously it's wet out there. Visibilities are varying coming quite low when we've got these heavy bands moving in. So be mindful, especially if there were to be a large vehicle in front of you, such as a tractor trailer, it is going to cause that spray to kick things up. This system, we've been watching it for quite some time. If you recall yesterday, you could barely see the edge of it, and it seemed as if it was knocking on our door. Well, it was slowly easing in. This is just moving at sloth speed, and we are receiving a lot of rain associated with it because it's not moving so fast. So our accumulation rates will be higher, especially north and west. Our cold front itself, the front of it, has already moved its way down to our south. Currently, temperatures still flirting with 50 over in Cookville. Then you head your way in Murray. You're already at 32. Winds continue to filter in out of our north, and as we go throughout the day, we're going to notice this lingering its way out. We'll have some cloudy skies, a scattered shower or two, and then we head into midnight. That's when our next system is going to move in as a warm front starting from our south, pushing northward. This will potentially bring us some strong to severe storms and also some really gusty winds on the severe threat. We're a one out of five, so we are on the lower end of things, but this is an overnight event. Here's a look over the next seven days. 48 degrees today, 70 in sunshine by tomorrow afternoon. We just got to get over that hump at midnight and then we'll begin to see mostly clear conditions going into the weekend. It's a chance for a scattered shower or two, but overall, Amy, things are looking up as we head into 2021.